We're finally getting that, dude. Like, look at Ikari there, man. We're gonna watch these kids shoot their brains out again. It's amazing. Hey, everybody. Before we get started, I just wanted to say, if you enjoy our content and want to stay up to date with our videos, hit the subscribe button. It really helps the channel. Thanks. So, on to the video. Hello, this is Adrian from my channel, Random Drop, and today's Summer's Game Fest. And there's been some big announcements today, but one that accidentally leaked today is a game I am very excited about. It is one of my favorite games ever made, and it was my first Persona game. And yeah, let, let's just get into it. I will talk about everything afterwards, but uh, I haven't watched this yet. Let, let's let's watch it. Xbox. Oh wait, there's no, no sound. There we go. There's some sound there. All right. An Xbox. <laughs> I guess, dude. It's so good to see her. Holy crap. I wonder if they're using the... Are they using like the Persona Dancing All Night models? Dude, the school, the teacher, Junpei, Ikari. Oh my god, that magic asshole kid. No, the cop that sells you weapons. Latin. Oh man. Dude, I wonder what they can do with Tartarus. Are they gonna keep it the same? Ah, that, that water motif is really good. What man, this is so sick. Is this a new song? Dude. Oh man, it looks so good. Persona 3 reload, dude. Early 2024. Sick. Xbox! <laughs> Xbox with Game Pass. Okay. Oh, I'll, I'll buy it on game. Oh. Okay. So it says Windows, so it doesn't look like I have to buy an Xbox. I don't really want to because I play everything on PC anyways. I play like three games on my PS5 a year. So it looks like there's a Windows version, which is good. I could hopefully like rig it to my Steam Deck. Hopefully there's a Steam version. Oh man, that, that's so exciting. The, the Xbox thing is throwing me the fuck off. I guess they got like an exclusive deal or something. Uh, but that's sick, man. Persona 3, holy crap. This is... It just all looks so beautiful. Whenever all these characters were showing up in like their dancing games and all that, it just made me wish like, dude, I, I really want to see these characters again in well done 3D, right? And in modern 3D and we're we're finally getting that deal. Like look at Ikari there, man. We're gonna watch these kids shoot their brains out again. It's amazing. Uh the menus they're still like Keeping them the same, it looks like, but they're using like Persona Five, like like angles, and, and they're doing stuff right, like they're stylizing the menus, because there was style in the first one, I believe, but it didn't have like this keep out stuff and all that, right? Or I don't remember. I think it was a lot more generic, I would say, or it just had like the color themes of it, but they didn't like, you know how they do the menus in Persona Five? They're incredible looking. So let's start from the beginning here. Again, the Xbox thing is throwing me off, but hey, they, they got them deals. Get that they get that cake, dude. Get get them dollars. Seeing Igus again after so many years. Oh man, she looks great. Seeing the school. So the thing is, right, is I wonder what they're gonna do with the female MC. I hope they don't can her or remove her so the thing about persona 3 is that you, you in the original persona 3 and on the male version of persona 3 portable you most of your social links were females right most of the social links were like females you would hang out with and could possibly romance by the end there were some male social links the vast majority of them were female and you could not hang out with Junpei, for example, or Akihiko, right? Um, Ken, I think you could hang out with the dog, I can't remember. That might have been a female MC. But when the female MC came out, they gave those social links to her. To where she could hang out with the whole cast, and the male side of the cast as well. And there was female-specific dialogue and stuff uh, made just for her. So I really wonder what they're going to do here. 
if they're gonna just be like blind faithful to the original game or is this gonna be amalgamation of the two or there are they gonna let you pick both or pick female male mc or female mc i would gladly play this game as female mc um the reason they don't do it in the other games is it's just a massive amount of work to do to make a female version of all like a lot of stuff but they kind of already did it or figured out the issues on for this game and like planned out the story with the female version so maybe it's less work and they can do it i think there would be an uproar or there'd be a lot of people who are disappointed if like the female MC is just gone uh it wouldn't like kill the game for me but it would it would stink quite a bit um i think at this point she's probably loved more than the the original main character um i mean like minato i think his name is minato now is like this emo kid wow Female MC is like this spunky girl, <laughs> like she's she's a smart ass and all that, so it's pretty great. Um, I really enjoy playing as her whenever I played Portable. I think I did it on my second playthrough. Yeah, I, I really wonder what they're gonna do. I miss seeing Miss Tor- Torumi Toriyumi here again. It's just her art looks the same, but it's just crisper now. It's so good. Fucking Junpei. Junpei's and it's so weird seeing these characters in like actual proportions because uh, Persona 3 had the Persona 4 effect where they had like big heads and shit. Um, and now seeing like a well, like Junpei is a young man, dude. He, uh, he, holy shit, it's so incredible to see him. Let's see. Let's just go down this. Seeing Yukari again. Um, and the thing is with the original Persona 3 Portable is. The portable version were just stills. There was no exploration of a 3D world. It was like you were playing a visual novel, and the only 3D parts were in the battles or in the dungeons. So the 90% of the story was told through a visual novel, right? So that's how it was easier to add female MC because they didn't have to make cutscenes. Um, but here it's going to be. The full game again, like Persona 3 Original, and the reason people don't like playing Persona 3 Original as much is because the combat is very... You can't control your fucking party members in that game, and the combat is so different. And the game is kind of fucking brutal. It's really hard, and part of the difficulty is because you literally can't micromanage your party members. You kind of just like, hey, you're supporting now. Do this, and then... Mitsuru casts Marin Karin when you need a heal, right? So it's hard to go back to that original game, even though like the 3D part is still there and people would enjoy that. So yeah, man, eh. God, it's so good seeing Yukari again. And yeah, the mall, you're going to come here a lot. Uh, Kenji, I remember Kenji being a douchebag, but like, that's all I remember about him. The cop that sells you guns, or oh, not guns, but weapons, melee weapons. The evokers. They didn't show any evoker scenes. Maybe that's like too touchy nowadays. I don't know. But I, I imagine the evoker. I mean, it's right there in her, on her leg thigh. Dude, holy crap. And we're fighting shadows again, man. Seeing shadows again brought to the modern age. Um, I, It looks like they probably grabbed the original models and spruced them up a bit. But... In Persona 5, you're fighting the Personas, the demons, right? So <laughs> they get to go... Oh, man, Igor Elizabeth, dude! Holy shit. It's so good to see her again. Can't wait for that social link. I'm sorry, I'm, 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 I'm so excited. This is Persona... Persona 3 might be my favorite game other than like the combat qualms I have with it and the, it being a portable version. I still like probably the tone of Persona 3 the most. So it, it getting like a second chance or a spruce up is awesome, right? And I hope that they bring this energy to Persona 2 at some point, man. Persona 2 is an incredible story and game. It's in holy shit the story for Persona 2 and Persona 
two two because it's two games. They deserve. They literally deserve a giant remake. Uh, because that story still holds up. It's still beautiful. I still love all the characters in Persona 2. So hopefully this kind of <laughs> builds up the road to that. But honestly, they probably might end up remaking Persona 4 at this point. Because they already have a lot of the fucking assets from the dancing game. Right? Like, uh, And then the shadows are the same too for Persona 4 Remake. So what? You just remake Inaba and make it look better? Like, a lot of the work is done already for Persona 2 for a remake. <laughs> Which, when you think about it, because they just did it here. And it shares a lot of that DNA with Persona 4. But I digress. Hey, like, comment, subscribe. How do you feel about this incredible announcement? Are you worried that the female MC is in the in, isn't in the game? Because I kind of am. I mean, I'll still play it and I'll still love it. But... <laughs> It's the fact that they didn't show her immediately because that's what everyone is wanting maybe they're just holding it back to fuck with people but that's like the first thing people want to hear from this game it's a remake female MC is in it incredible sold everyone who has ever loved Persona 3 immediately buys that game but um, yeah I digress and <laughs> will this lead to Persona 4 remake which I think I think it will. Uh, Persona 4 is an old game now. Yeah, Jesus, that was like 12 years ago. But it came at the end of the PS2 era. So there's a lot of things that were just outdated immediately. If they remake Persona 4, they need to cut all the golden shit out. Please do not add the golden stuff. And just make raw Persona 4. That is the one where you could cut back and remove the additions, because no one likes them. And then go find Chie's voice actress drag her whatever hole she's at in and get her back in the booth because Persona 4 remake happens, we need her back the tomboy voice is much better and not to discredit the replacement voice actress I think she did fine, but I just like the first one more um, and then Copium here's praying for Persona 2 remake I will probably be 50 by the time they make that game but I, God damn it, I'll buy it. See you later.